tonight's game, uh, England against Denmark. I think if you look at it um, logically, you you have to fancy England. Um, maybe Schmeichel apart, or maybe Hoiberg. They might be the only two Danish players that would threaten to to get into the England team. So. From that perspective, I think England have the, the better players. Um, I think if, if both teams play to the full capabilities, I think England win. Uh, but saying that, we've seen this tournament that Denmark have a, a resilience and a togetherness, obviously cemented by the, uh, the events of the first game regarding Christian Eriksen. The, uh, the captain and the senior players in that Danish squad of have, have led the team excellently uh, as as the head coach so certainly Denmark can't be underestimated as I say they're they're good solid professional football players with 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 good ability but you have to say you know the likes of Kane and Sterling uh, Grealish if he gets on uh, Maguire uh, Stones uh, Luke Shaw down the left whether it be Trippier or Walker down the right. I think if those players play up to standard and England come, obviously, backed by a, a party sand crowd, uh, I think the smart money has to be on, on an England victory. But uh, as England fans, we know only too well, uh, too many occasions we have, uh, have uh, threatened to deceive or got into great positions and, and, and failed to deliver. But again, if you look at it from a, a logical point of view, if you'd have offered England uh, a home semi-final against Denmark uh, with the chance of playing Italy in the final, it it doesn't get much better than that. I mean, we could easily be lining up against the likes of, uh, of France or Portugal or Spain. Uh, and I think any, any English fan and anybody connected in the England camp would snack your hands off with a chance of, of, of playing Denmark. Hopefully it's a great game. Hopefully it's a, a, a great spectacle like last night. Everyone that goes to the game hopefully stays safe and well. But uh, at the moment, I have to say, I can't see anything else other than, a, than an English victory. Thank you.